let's go to Google and search for Amazing Grace. We will use Amazing Grace for this tutorial. Our first task is to find the song key. This is usually the first and the last chord. Once you know the song key, it's time for the next step. Find the column on the conversion chart that matches the song key. This chart can be downloaded from the Cortica forum. Now we're ready to do the switching. Find all the instances of a particular letter and switch it around with its corresponding number. If you see a chord without a M, major or minor indicator behind it, you will take it as a major. You can also safely ignore the numbers behind chords. I will show you now how to handle a slash chord. In this example, we see a slash chord on top of the word grace. After you have replaced the alphabets with the corresponding numbers, it's better that you flip the number positions around. 1 slash 3m would then be written as 3 colon 1. We do this to avoid confusion. 3 is thus played on the left side of the cortica and 1 is played on the right. In the number sheet, we call this a split. Notice that there is also no need to write the tree with an M. This is true for all numbers on the left side of the cortica. Let's take a final look at the end result. I hope that this has been helpful for you, and if you still have any problems, do feel free to write your questions at the Cortica forum.